Um, yeah, my face is actually on camera. Wow, you can put a face to this voice. This horribly annoying voice, and I hope I don't break your screens. Sorry. So, um, today, I thought that me, and of course, our mascot, Bulbasaur, would go through the collection of cards that I have currently. Um, you've only seen me unbox a small selection of XY Evolutions. Now, I have been collecting Pokemon cards for a few months from now. Oh yeah, by the way, that's a fly strip. We get a lot of flies in England when you leave the windows open when it's hot. So, yeah, ignore that please. Yeah, bye, get the fuck out of here. See you later, mate. Anyway, um, where was I? So yeah, I'm um, just going to show you a small collection of what I have so far. And I hope everyone's doing alright. And thank you for those who have been watching my videos. And anyone that's left feedback, it's greatly appreciated. And also, please, please, like and subscribe. Uh, it helps me out so much as a starting YouTuber. And I'm the sort of person that will stay 100% loyal to my fans. Or any subscribers. I wouldn't really call you fans. Because it's not really a fan thing. I'm not a celebrity. And even if I got massive in YouTube, I still wouldn't be a celebrity. I just really appreciate you guys who have watched the videos. Who have liked and commented. And yeah. I'll always give back. As soon as I start getting bigger. And I start getting more views and stuff. I'll start doing competitions, you know, co-card giveaways. I've got a good 50 co-cards in the kitchen that I'll be giving away sooner or later. Um, so yeah, let's start off today's video with the Jumbo cards. Starting off with the Charizard EX, and I can't really remember what set this is from, but here it is. This is the only Jumbo card I have that's actually from a set where the others are promos. So. There's a Charizard EX. You're probably thinking, why is he not getting out of the box? I'm really worried about bending my cards. I'm so sorry. If anyone knows if I can get any sort of like comic book, small comic book size sleeves that I can put these sort of cards in, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, if so, let me know in the comments, please. Right, so next video. Next video. Next card. Do I even know English? Right, next card is an XY promo. This is XY121. It is Charizard EX. I mean, he's, he's, he's a gorgeous card, whether he's the smaller version or the big one, it's, it's amazing artwork. And hey, who doesn't know when Love Charizard? Great Pokemon. And next up after that, we have not one, but two XY123s Venusaur EXs. Now, these were from Red and Blue Collection, so was the other Charizard that was XY. Um, they're from Red and Blue Collection. The other Charizard that was from a set, I generally do not remember what box that's from. If I do remember, maybe I'll bring it back up one day, but who knows? And last but not least, I will actually have to pull this one at the box because there's damage counters and stuff blocking it. It is the XY154 promo, and it is the Jumbo Ho-Oh Break Card. Caesar inducing. Seriously, Caesar inducing. But so good. Such a good card. Let's just quickly put him back in the box. By the way, sorry if you can hear a, a bit of noise. I, uh, I've i got a French Bulldog at the minute. Um, just doing his thing, being nosy in the window. There's his little butt. <laughs> little butt. So, uh, yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm sure you people don't want to see dog butts, but some people might. Weirdos. Anyway, <laughs> carry on with the video. God, it's hard to get this camera balanced again. I knew I shouldn't have picked it up. All right, nearly. Nearly. Perfect. Right, so let's start off with the smallest of binders, which is the Ultra Pro Pokemon Trading Card Game Binder. This is the smaller one. There is bigger ones available. Um, this, because it's only a little, I have a few promos in, a few secret rares and ultra rares, I believe might be in this book as well. But this contains the Radiant Collection, which is also not known as the Cute Collection, which is a collection of cards that you get one, sometimes two, if you're very lucky, randomly stashed in the pack of Pokemon Generations. So, on the first page, we have Chikorita, Shroomish, Charmeleon, and Charmander. I'm missing 11 cards from this set, so it's not far off. There's only about, what, 32, is it? 32, yeah. So, I believe that's Charizard missing there. But then we have the Flareon EX. Then we have Froslass and Snorunt. Then we have Raichu. I believe it's D Denny. Might be wrong. Um, bit of a weird spell in there. After that, we have 
Wob Effect and Go Pin. Next page, we have Jirachi and Meow Stick. The artwork's really nice on these guys. Like, they're all reverse, well, most of them are reverse holo rares um, and have that pattern. There's a few other that doesn't. Um, and then on the page on its own, on the other side is, what's that? Is that Flababe or something? <laughs> Flababe? Flababe? Oh, 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 la Flababe. Oh, <laughs> Right. Next after that, we have the reverse holo Diancy on its own up here. These are just the cards on the page before. Um, then we have Fletchling and Flareon EX here and here. And then on the page, which would be the last page, I'm just missing one from there, which this is Pikachu, Garvador EX and Mega Garvador EX. The artwork for these two cards are beautiful. And this is probably my most favourite Pikachu card that I own or in existence. Yeah, even cuter than the ones when he used to be fat. And then here we have a few rare holo reverse that I've got doubles off and uh, mainly promo. So we've got the two breaks and promos, the Black Kai Room and the reverse rare Gyarados on this page. And then on the other page we have the Lapras GX Full Art Ultra Rare, which I have a two of now. The Sammy Rot Reverse Hollow. And then I have a Litten and a Vulpix. This is the Hollow promo, and this is a Toys R Us Hollow promo. And when you buy certain packs from Toys R Us, you get that card. Um, I have two Toga Demarus on their own up here. Also both promos. And then I have the Mega Houndoom EX and the Tauros GX, which I have about three of these cards now. Uh, on the next page, we have the two Venusaur EX smaller versions that come with the big versions in the uh, previous Jumbo cards I've shown you. And then we have the Wob Effect and the ho -Oh Break cards there and there. On to the next book is going to be two Black Ultra Pro binders, which once again are really good. I do recommend these like I did in one of the other videos. I believe it was the first video I made. Um, if you haven't got these yet, I recommend getting them because like, unlike that one that I've just shown you, these are top loaders, so they can be quite annoying when trying to load or trying to put the cards in and trying to keep them straight and stop them from falling out. So, on to the next bit. We have the, I believe, yeah, this Pokemon XY Evolutions, which has been opening. I don't know how I didn't know that by heart. Uh, like I said in one of the videos, it's the original base print, reprint of the re original base set in 1999, I think. So on the first card, we have Venusaur EX, followed by Caterpie and Metapod. Then we have Weedle, Kakuna, Beedrill, Tangela, Charmander, Charmeleon and Charizard Hollow. I wish this was the original first edition card. They're worth so much. By the minute, it's worth about £15, Great Britain. Okay. After that, we have the Reverse Hollow Vulpix. And then... Following that page, we have Growlithe, Arcanine, Ponyta, Magma. Then we have Poliwag and Poliwhirl. On the next page, we have Seal on his own. There is quite a few cards missing from this set, I must let you know. I'm hoping to complete these sets as we go along. On the next page, we have Dugong and Staryu. And then Starmine and Magic Carp. Page after that, we have the reverse hollow Pikachu and Magnemite. After that page, we have the reverse hollow Magneton, followed by Voltorb, Electrode, and Electro Buzz. And on the page after that, we have Zapdos, reverse hollow, a Need Aran, a Need a Reno, and a Nido Queen, reverse hollow. Then we have Ghastly, reverse hollow. Haunter Reverse Hollow and a regular Drowsy, followed by a Reverse Hollow Coffin and Reverse Hollow Mewtwo. Absolutely love this card. Beautiful artwork on a Mewtwo, I think, personally, it's just me. I mean, who doesn't love a Mewtwo? And then we've got some more regulars Sandshrew, Diglett, Dogtrio, Machop. And then we have Machoke, Machamp Hollow, Machamp Break, and Onyx. Followed by a Pidgeot 
EX and a Rata Ratata Far Fetched and Doju a Dojuo Porygon and a Pokemon Spirit Link, which is the Blastoise one. I just said Porygon, really weird, didn't I? Seriously, don't know English today, guys. Followed by some more trainers. Brock's Gift, Charisbard Spirit Link, Charizard Spirit Link. God, what is wrong with me today? Devolution Spray and Energy Retrieval. There's the cards. I'm just going to start reading these off from the front to stop myself from saying any more pronunciations wrong and then show the artwork to you. So we have the Reverse Hollow Full Heal, Maintenance, Misty's Termination, Pidgeot Spirit Link on this page. And then we have Pokedex, a Potion, Provess's Oak Hint, and Revive here. Then we have a Slowbo Spirit Link, a Super Potion, Switch Reverse Hollow, and Venusaur Spirit Link on that page. Followed by a Full Art Double Colorless Energy, and a Reverse Hollow Water Energy. Followed by a Reverse Hollow Energy card, which is the Electric, and I believe this might be... Might be Earth, I can't really remember. I'm not really too good with the energy cards. I don't really play the game, I just like collecting the cards. Um, we skipped a few pages, and this is where the set would end on this page. But across from that page, we have. Oh, skipped too many pages there. Across from that page, we do have the two secret rares of the set so far, which is the Flying Pikachu and Imancuni's Dojuo. Sorry about that guys, my camera died. Um, moving on into the next Ultra Pro binder, because that was the end of the last one I've just shown you. This contains quite a few promo cards, and also has the Sun and Moon, original Sun and Moon set. So okay, once again, I'm going to read off the names and then show the pictures to you. So we have Reverse Hollow Caterpie, Metapod, Butterfree and Paras in the first page. And yeah, um, there's missing cards and stuff. That's not because um, I've been stupid with placement. I've actually tried to do them in order. But um, obviously, ones I haven't got, then they need to leave a space so I know where to put them. Ooh, pardon me. Sorry, guys. Manners don't cost nothing. Remember that, kids. And the next page, we have a Parasect, a Pinsir, a Surskit, and a Masquerade. Page after that, we have a Reverse Hollow Rowlet, a Dartrix, and a Reverse Hollow... I think it's a Deku die. Once again, a Pokemon I really, really probably just butchered the name of. <laughs> Moving on, we have a Grobin, a Fromantis, and a Morlul. Bounce Sweet on his own up here. Poor lonely little guy. Right. We have a Reverse Hollow Growlithe, a Torkoal, a Litten, a Toracat, an Incineroar, and a Psyduck. So... First three I read out, second three I read out. Then we have a reverse hollow gold duck, a polywag, a polywool, a polywool, a polywhirl. Seriously need to fix my uh, speaking skills, guys. Like my vocabulary is usually on point and my pronunciation is usually on point. For the past couple of videos, it's just been horrible. A polyrath, a shoulder, a cloister, and a cosola. Next ones, we have a Wingle, a Pelipa, and a Poplio. After that, we have a Primarina, a Carbominable, Carbominable, and a Wishy Washy. Oh, yeah, Wishy Washy. <laughs> it's a joke, don't take offence. <laughs> right, next page, we have a Reverse Hollow Dupoida, Acronid, a fucking Pokemon I really don't know how to pronounce the name of, I'll show you it in a minute, and a Bruxish. But seriously, what the fuck is that? Then we have a reverse hollow chin chow and a normal lantern. Oops, sorry. Then we have a regular Todimaru. Zubat, a reverse hollow Golbat, a reverse hollow Grimer, a hollow low and muck. That's a low and grimer, sorry, as well, before the muck. Drowsy, Reverse Hollow, and a regular Hypno. And then we have 
a Marini, a Cosmog, a Cosmoum, a Makuhita, and a Hariyama. All regulars there. Then we have a Rogan Roller, Rogan Roller. Seriously, guys, fix up. <laughs> Stay in school, kids. A Boulder, a Crab Roller, a Passamine, a Zandigast, a Palo Sand, and a Lowen Ratata. After that, we have a, a Lowen Meowth, a Lowen Persian, a Umbri Umbrian GX. Seriously, how am I not pronouncing words today? There goes my camera, thank you for so. This guy moved, as you know. He, uh, he's got a mind of his own, this one. Get out of here, piece of shit. Right. A Kavana, a Sand Isle, and a Karaka Rock. Then we have an Alloan Diglett, a Alloan Dog Trio, Skarmory, a Gramble, Snubble, and a Cutie Fly. How's it going, bros? My name's Cutie Pie. It's all right, little cutie fly. I won't do that again. Sorry, guys. We have a Rimbombi, a Dratini, a Dragonair, a Spearow, a Fero, a Kangas Khan, and a Tauros GX. There, there, guys. I know this is really boring. I'm sorry. I just want to show the sort of uh, collections I've started at the minute. We have an Eevee, a Spinder, a Lillipop, a Herdia, all there. A Stoutland, a Picky Peck, a Trumbeak, and a Two Cannon. Then followed by a Reverse Hollow Young Goose, a Gumshoes GX, a Stuffwall, a Beware, an Oranguru, and a Reverse Hollow Energy Retrieval. Then we have the Energy Switch, XP Share, Great Ball, How. Lima, Lily, Nest Ball, and Poison Barb. Followed by that, we have the Pokeball, the Pokemon Catcher, Professor Kukui, Reverse Hollow, Reverse Hollow Rare Candy, a Repel, a Rotom Dex, and a Switch. After that, we have a Team School Grunt, a Reverse Hollow Timer Ball. An Ultra Ball, a Double Colourless Energy, a Rainbow Energy, and the Caesar Inducing Lapras GX card. And then we're missing pretty much 10 spaces from 139 to 149, but carrying on from that, we have the one of the secret rares in the set, which is the All Gold Full Art Psychic Energy. And then after that, this is where the promos begin. And some of them are normal cards, like, for example, I have two Pikachus here, but they have the barcodes from the back from when the generations first come out. That's the reason I kept them like that in this book. So we have the Charizard EX and Charizard EX, the other two from the Jumbos I was showing you earlier. The one that's an XY promo, the other one that's from one of the random sets I collect. And the two Pikachus I was just telling you about with two Littons, two different art Littons. Uh, if you watch my other videos, you'll know that one of my other goals is to collect every Pikachu possible. Absolutely of Pikachu. Don't know why, I just always have. As well as our little friend Bulbasaur that I threw. I'm sorry, little Bulbasaur. Get out of here. Piece of shit. Then we have a Rowlet, a Poplio, a Lugia, and a ho -Oh, all XY promos. Moving on. We have... I'm not going to go through all these cards. I'm just going to basically show you that we have a crap ton of doubles. Right, so some of the doubles are... The, oh right, first of all, I'm going to show you. Basically, I have two Elite Trainer boxes in the other videos. Um, haven't opened them in the videos, but I did get both of these from Chaos Cards. And people are probably thinking, oh, I have two videos about Chaos Cards. Um, I'm not actually sponsored. I mean, pardon me for that, but I'm sorry, that's why I pause for a minute. Um, I'm not actually sponsored by them. I wish I was. I'm just literally seeing where I got things from. And always, when I mention certain brands or places I get them from, I always leave a link in the description below. You know, below that subscribe and like button. <laughs> that creep was really winky. I mean, that wink was really creepy. Oh my god, here we go again. Screw you, Bulbasaur. So in here we have... Wait a minute. That's not Pokemon. Oh, these are uh, what they call 
you know, different style things. Uh, and they use them as mana in the game Magic the Gathering. Um, basically, in here, we have nothing but Sun and Moon doubles. Um, apart from obviously any GX and stuff, they go in the folders and inside their own visual sleeves into the folders. They really protected for uh, later on the day, where if I want to trade or sell. And I've actually sat through all my cards, you'll see doubles and arranged them into different sets and in order. So these are all in order. There's quite a few cards here. Yeah. I think there's a, at least a good hundred doubles there. Um, also in this box, this is only a small box of cards. This is just literally Sun and Moon, obviously them magic cards as you've just seen. Um, like the Pikachus, I got these from the uh, 20th anniversary promos. And obviously, like I said, they've all got the barcodes. I'm not my Pikachus having the fold up. I want the Pikachus out because I'm collecting Pikachus. It's, just something I've always done. I've got loads of coins in there from Pokemon. Um, so let's go and close this one up, put it back in its sleeve. I have the checklists here as well. So the next one, also like I said from Chaos Cards, is the purple Sun and Moon Elite Trainer box. And in here we have loads of different card separators. So I've got a few cards. Uh, how many is here from the cute collection doubles? Let's have a look. So just just here on its little alone, we have these just these little free cards here from the uh, cute collection doubles. And then after that, we have two separate poles upside down to each other. This one is from. Oh, where's this from? Ah, this one is from one of the XYs. So is this one. And then here we have. A crap ton of energy cards because obviously if anyone bought elite trainer box you'll know that you get a pack of 60 energy cards every time you buy an elite trainer box doesn't matter what set it's from or what what collection it's pretty much a standard thing you'll find along with the dice and cards and other stuff um then we have doubles from the what set is this from the generation set which i will be showing you in the minute i've got a folder separated for generations i'm just telling you about all my doubles and stuff i have um, then we've got doubles for things like more Sun and Moon doubles, uh, X, Y, H and Origins. You get the point. Um, you're probably thinking, where's all the sleeves? Well, I've used all the sleeves and had to buy more. Like Today I had to buy like another 300 because I'm planning to get so uh, at least another 30 packs of boosters with 10 cards in each one. So that's another 300 gone. But they're not too bad. I use Ultra Pro sleeves for about, mm, about 199 299 something like that for about 50 cards where I live in the UK. Um... And then moving on to the last binder, which is this big boy over here. Not actually anything important. I used to use it to collect football cards when I was younger. Um, this is basically just some generations. Now we have Caterpie, Metapod, Paras and Parasect in the first four there. These are nine page pockets, so I might have to move the camera around a bit to show you. But there's ones that I've only got four, maybe six in the page. I can show you all in once, hopefully, if they're all in the bottom half. Um, Ponyta and Magma, and then we have the Blastoise EX, the Vaporon EX, and some normal cards. I'm not really going to read them all out this time, guys. I'm just going to read out the really important ones and then just quickly, well, not quickly, just quicker scans over the cards so you can see what's there. Next page, we have some mm, regular rares, hollow rares, and stuff. So we've got you know, gold bats and the Geo dudes. Stuff like that. Then after that we have Golem EX in this page. And that's the only EX on these two pages. But once again, I'm just going to scan through these cards with you. Because the video is going to be really long of course, guys. And I don't want you getting really bored. Because I know this sort of content, unless you're interested, it can be quite boring. Um, I'm just trying to please the viewers that I actually have currently got at the minute. Just so they know what sort of things I'm collecting and what I'm about. Um, and obviously, this beautifully ugly face. Creepy smile. I really need to stop doing facial expressions on the camera. It's not good. It's not good. <laughs> <laughs> right. The Mancuni. I don't know why I read them out. It's not only X. These are just, once again, some basic cards. And I believe that energy card there and the next two on the top page here is the end of Generations. And then we've just got some random cards, spares, and cards I like the look of. I'm not really going to flip through them, guys. But, um, yeah. I need to go grab one more thing to show you. So I'll be back in a minute, guys. And I'm back with another item. Bloody camera. Stay the fuck still. Meh. Meh. That's better. Right, so the last item, once again, is an Ultra Pro item. 
it's a deck and dice collecting well collecting storage combo whatever you want to call it um, on the very bottom you can pull out and this is where people would use keep the dices for other games um, the dice I use for Pokemon are stored somewhere else in another Pokemon section where I have all my Pokemon dice from Elite Trainer Box etc and all these sleeve cards and the sleeves you see here are all Pokemon XY Evolution doubles so we've got the energies and again once again it's all all in order I mean fucking hell Caterpie straight away as soon as you kick it off five Caterpies and we've got one two two Weedles the weed light and XY Evolutions is really weird. Like, it just looks so like it's meant to be faded, but I think that might be part of the artwork. I'm pretty sure it is. Uh, and then we have not one but two Kakunas. Then we have a reverse hollow Beedrill and the normal Beedrill. And then we have Tanglers. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, what, five Charmanders there. And then we have one Charmeleon double. Then we have one, two, three. Got a really itchy nose today, guys. Really itchy. They say it's a sign of an argument, but I don't see it having an argument. I've had a really good day today. I don't like arguing. I don't. I don't like confrontation. I like to be laid back and placid. Um, four full pixels. Then we have one, two, three, three Growlithe's, followed by a. Arcanine, level 45 beast. We have Ponytars, Poliwags, Poliwurls. You get the gist. I'm not going to sit here and go for every single one because, like, again, it's, this video is going to be absolutely massive, it is, guys. And I don't really, really, really don't want to bore you as more as I already have. Um, hopefully, my content's a bit better now. I've got my face on camera. Um, hopefully, I'm just getting used to it. I mean, like, I, I suffer with um, anxiety and a few issues. I'm not going to get into it. That's not what I'm here for. I'm here to do Pokemon. But I'm just letting you guys know that I, I do feel really anxious and nervous when doing videos. Yeah, I shouldn't do. It's just me in a room with the camera. I mean, right now I'm on the floor like an idiot, but it's just more space. Isn't it? There's Ono. There's the little Frenchie. Hey, boy. Hey. There's the Frenchie. <laughs> Who looks just like Bulbasaur. But anyway, um, as I was saying, yeah, I do find anxious. Um, anxiety makes me anxious and these videos obviously it's going to make me anxiety, anxious it's anxiety but it makes me feel anxious no matter what I do and that's probably why sometimes I mess up my words or I try um, being funny when I'm not um, I'm just literally trying to find my feet and once I find my feet I'm starting to get more confident like now I'm finding really confident he thinks he's a cat he's so nosy every time he hears a noise in that street on the windowsill but anyway guys thanks for watching please like this video subscribe whatever you want a twitter will be down in the description with chaos cards website check them out if you ever want anything and you live in the uk they might deliver abroad i'm not sure um but they have a massive massive range of delivery wherever you want the standard delivery you know all the raw mail tracked options 24 48 etc um saturday mainland delivery which mainland means like the uk and uh, united kingdom um but yeah once again thanks for watching guys like i said please like and subscribe it really helps out the channel and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye. One more thing I almost forgot, guys. Um, the next few videos might be recorded through my PC as I might be doing the Pokemon TCG online. Um, some pack openings. Maybe I might even do some online battles against people. Um, but, yeah. Once again, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.